girls, we are continuing our adventure through the Bible, trying to find out what problem is too big for God. But before we do that, let's go ahead and worship God. Remember, worship is singing songs with our whole minds, our whole bodies, and our whole hearts. So go ahead and stand up so we can get our bodies ready for worship. I want you to spin around in three circles. One, two, three. Whoa, I'm dizzy. So let's go ahead and get our hearts ready for worship. Go ahead, hold your hands, close your eyes, and repeat after me. Hi God, thank you for loving me. I want to worship you with my whole mind, my whole body, and my whole heart. I love you. In your name, amen. Now that our minds, our bodies, and our hearts are ready, let's move into worship. We live in a great big world that needs to hear about a great big love. We need to tell the story to every little boy and girl. We gotta go, go, go. Jesus said to go, go, go. We need to tell the story of Jesus and his love.
another story to every little boy and girl. So go, 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 go into all the world. Go, 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 teach the good news. Go, 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 go into all the world. Go, 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 teach the good news. Jesus loves them and he loves you. Yeah. Great job worshiping. We really worship God with our whole minds, our whole bodies, and our whole hearts. But we didn't answer the question, what problem is too big for God? In the Bible, there's a story about Jesus that can teach us all about this question. Let's go! Jesus had finished teaching. Everyone was hungry. Send them away to buy food, his disciples said. But Jesus wanted to show the people that they could trust God. Why don't you feed them? Jesus asked. It would take a year's wages to buy bread for them all, his disciples cried. How much food do you have? asked Jesus. There is a boy here, said Andrew, who has five loaves of bread and two little fish. Jesus smiled. Perfect. Tell the people to sit down on the grass. So the people sat down all over the mountainside. Jesus thanked God for the bread and the fish. Then he broke them into pieces for his disciples to hand out. Jesus' disciples passed out bread and fish to the whole crowd. There were 5,000 men and lots of women and children, too. Everyone ate as much as they wanted. Afterwards, the disciples gathered up the leftovers. There were 12 baskets full from just five loaves and two fish. The people knew they could trust God to care for them. Wow, what an amazing miracle Jesus did in our story. Jesus showed us that nothing is too hard for God. God's power is bigger than any of our problems. And we can trust God to take care of us. Jesus was definitely the star in this story, but we can learn something from someone else. It was the little boy with his lunchbox. He gave the little lunch that he had to Jesus and Jesus multiplied that for thousands of people. The little boy showed us that when we see someone that needs help, we can give them what we have and then give it to God to take care of the rest. And in our Bible verse, it says, O Lord, you made the heavens and the earth. Nothing is too hard for you. Let's say it again, but let's say it super, super quiet. Oh Lord, you made the heavens and the earth. Nothing is too hard for you. Now I want you to say it so loud that I can hear you all the way over here. Oh Lord, you made the heavens and the earth. Nothing is too hard for you. Great job, that was so loud, I could hear you all the way over here. There is nothing in heaven or on earth that is too big for God. God loves us and will take care of us no matter what. Let's take some time to thank God for being big enough to handle all of our problems. Go ahead, fold your hands, close your eyes, and repeat after me. Hi God. Thank you for being big enough to help me no matter what. I love you. In your name, amen. Now we get to go do a fun song with Mr. Music. Let's go! Okay, friends. We're going to start with the part where we sing about God's big, strong power. Oh. My God, my God is big. 
My God is big and strong and powerful. My God, my God is big. My God is big and strong and powerful. <laughs> Isn't that fun? <laughs> yeah. Let's sing the whole song. I can try. I'll do my very best, but only God can take care of the rest. Oh, I can trust God will take care of me, cause nothing is too hard for God. My God, my God is big, my God is big and strong and powerful. My God, my God is big. My God is big and strong and powerful. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> I can try. I'll do my very best, but only God can take care of the rest. Oh, I can trust. God will take care of me, cause nothing is too hard for God. My God, my God is big. My God is big and strong and powerful. My God, my God is big. My God is big and strong and powerful. My God is big and strong and powerful. My God is big and strong and powerful. <laughs> yeah. Friends, I had such a fun time with you on our Bible adventure. We learned that when we see a problem, we can give what we can to help and then give it to God to take care of the rest. Next week, we're gonna learn more about what God can do. I can't wait to see you then. And remember, you are loved. Bye!